we talk when we say the word like abundance, it kind of in in our mind we hear it as finances. So um, you know, if you also want to type in like how are you how long have you been trying to expand your financial situation or your financial abundance? Um, that's another way to to say that question. All right, Marguerite, what's up, girl? Uh, Marguerite's also in our manifestation masterclass. Really, my whole life on abundance, have worked many years on self gratitude. Uh, Beverly Brennan, working on financial abundance again for the past year. I've tried the secret. Abraham Hicks, beautiful. Mark Laughlin, A, about two years. B, I meditate and work to take responsibility for my life. Love it. I'm cultivating gratitude. I'm learning to take care of myself and facing the feelings of not being worthy. Beautiful. Barbara, six years working on financial abundance, meditation, law of attraction, gratitude work. Beautiful. Hey, Brett. Welcome to the party. Down under. Uh, Kelly <laughs> Joe, two years, checked out Mind Valley, Mind Movies, energy work, but nothing seemed to hit me and made me think until now. About a year and a half. Okay, so we're pretty much, if I could just kind of sum everybody up, I'd say we're all in an average of looking at abundance. I'm just going to call it two years. I know some were one, one some were six, some were three, et cetera. Let's just call it two three years, if we want to say something like that. Um, and, you know, Kelly Jo said something really interesting that she's tried to do a bunch of things, but nothing seemed to have hit or made her think. Um, let me see what else people wrote here. Abundance in relationships and love both. Love both for others about myself. After years of looking outside for a fix over the past few months, you guys have really helped to bring awareness that it starts within. Beautiful. You guys are taking all my material. <laughs> um, four months, I've been working on this. I've tried many teachings on manifestation from all angles and I've manifested many amazing things in my life before money. Amazing relationship, but now I'm trying everything I want. Something are coming, but not coming as easy as I thought. Why? Beautiful. <laughs> Kevin Humphrey. For the win, 50 years in abundance ceiling. Last three years, some awesome training with two gorgeous chaps has shattered my ceiling. Now looking to grab rocket to the stars, always learning and implementing. Awesome. Okay. I'm that, I'm that awesome chap. <laughs> <laughs> me too. That's you and me. Um, all right. So here's what I'm creating for all of us. And I want you to know, I want you to let me know in the comment box if you resonate with this and if you're down to play this game with us today. Okay. What we're creating today is a line in the sand moment. What do I mean by that? I mean that you at the end of this live will have an opportunity to draw a line in the sand such that there is going to be a before this moment and your life around abundance and a clear after this moment with your life around abundance. And I mean that in the most profound way possible. I don't remember exactly who said it. I think it was Joe Messina said about looking inward. This line in the sand moment is that. It's giving up the right to meddle and try to fix your external situation. The reason you guys have been operating in this place for the last two, three, six years or whatever it is, is because everything you've been doing is working out there. What we're going to start to look at, where we're going to show you what we've put together here is how you can take a deep dive internally to alter your financial thermostat, to alter and upgrade every limiting belief and program that you have around money, most of which were given to you before you're even conscious enough to understand what money even is. And then you've built your entire world and belief systems around it. I read something today, a little bit off topic here, but, but powerful nonetheless, that when parents have certain fears about certain things like, you know, say there's, there's people that have very rigid lifestyles, meaning like things have to be a very specific way. Okay. So just use that as an example. 
by the virtue of them showing up that way, they automatically imbue that into not only the fetus, the unborn fetus in the body, right? Because the energy is constantly swirling around. But as soon as that baby's born, because what do we want as parents? We want the best for our child. So what do we send to them? All of our concerns about the world and all the things that we don't want for them to happen and all these things. And so we've been programmed with a lot of this stuff around money. So that's really what I want to create for us, all of us here today, uh, whether you're listening to this live or you'll be listening to this later on a replay. Um, so does that resonate with you? Are you guys down to play that kind of game? Because that's really what we want to deliver here. Go ahead, hit some emojis or comment away. Let us know. Let us know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Marguerite says deal. I think that was prior to the question. Let them give him a hot, hot second. Say it again. I said that was right prior to that question. Give him a hot second to respond. Okay. Probably catch up right now. In. Yo, yo. Awesome. Marguerite in. Guys, how, guys, how many of you guys are getting that when it comes to wealth building, by the way, wealth to us doesn't necessarily just mean money alone. There is wealth of happiness, wealth of joy, wealth of sex. Like wealth is like, you know, kind of you probably can't see it right now, but the, the have it all moniker that's sitting behind Elon's head, that that's what we talk about, right? It's a, it's a wealth of things. So we are going to specifically talk about everyone's favorite thing in the world, money here. And if you go through the comment box, you kind of get that people have done a lot of things to try to change the inner programming about money. Now, if programming is within, doing things out here, like Elon said, is not a complete waste of time. Certainly reading books, going through courses opens up doors for us. However, if we are unwilling to have an experience that ultimately alters us, you're really playing from behind. If you really look at the moments that massively shifted your life in any direction, whether traumatic or whether an ecstatic joy, there was an experience that we can say not only affected the way that you thought, more powerfully affected the way that you feel. Um, you'll oftentimes hear Elon and I talking about energy fields and uh, emotional bodies and stuff like that. So even from a scientific perspective, and this doesn't have to be scientific, the output of your mind, the energy field that sits around your head, goes out about eight inches. The energy field that emanates from your heart goes out about eight feet. And we can prove, right, by kind of like a roundabout way, that the energy that your body emits and the way that you feel about something is about 500,000 times stronger than the way that you think about it. A lot of people are, spend a lot of time investing their time and energy and trying to manage their thoughts. Oh, if I just think positively, everything will work out great. How's that going? I could sit here all day long and go, oh, I'm gonna be a millionaire. Oh, I'm gonna be a millionaire. Oh, this millionaire thing's gonna happen any day now. However, if every time I do that, my body, my felt sense as lived experience, electromagnetic impulse output from my body is not in agreement with that thought, I'm actually programming in the very programming I'm trying to get rid of. This is something we're going to talk about in a lot more detail today. It's how do you create an alignment, not just around abundance, certainly abundance for all of us, right? But like, how do you create alignment in really every area of your life? How do you get what you think about to match what you feel about? Because if what you feel about is not in a match of what you think about, that, that's why you get working on stuff for five years and it doesn't end up really producing that result. And it doesn't mean it doesn't get results because we certainly have a lot of evidence in this world that working really hard gets results. The Gary Vaynerchuks and I'd even say the Tony Robbins and like a lot of these more masculine patriarchal type teachings that have been out there for a long time, they get results. You got to check in with yourself though, if a, either A, that's working for you, B, that's in alignment with you, or C, is that really how you want to get results in life? If I had a choice in life between living into a world in my perceptive reality that's difficult, hard, people have been manipulate, steal, take advantage of one another. You guys get how that creates a certain context for living, not just in how I perceive the world, but how I feel about things. 
And then if what we're outputting and what we attract to ourselves is based on the feeling within our body, and I'm in a state of worry, like Elon was saying before, these worries that we pass down to our children, notice how you worry as if worrying is resolving the issue. Uh, thinking that worry is going to resolve the issue is like, me holding this glass bottle in my hand and because I don't see any bears around, I think that it's because I'm holding this glass bottle in my hand. Like it's saving me from bears. I think it was a Baz Luhrmann said, uh, worrying is um, like chewing bubble gum to solve arithmetic. <laughs> Something like that. So if, if that's the case, then this conversation gets to be about how do you start feeling the way that's in alignment with the results that you want before you have the results that you want, not after. Because that's the game that most people are playing. They think if they fill their intellect with enough information, they know the right things to do, then they'll feel safe enough to take the actions. When they take the actions, they'll get the results. Maybe finally when they get their results, they'll finally feel the way they're supposed to feel about feeling abundant. I don't know about you guys, that's a lot of steps to feel something. How many of you guys know that right now, if you go and put yourself into a meditative state, there's an alpha, beta, gamma wave you can drop yourself into. And even if you drop down just one level, meditation is its own form of hypnosis. And that you can actually feel anything that you want to feel, just like when you're in a dreaming state, there's really no difference between our dream state and our awakened state. And if we never actually woke up from our dream state, we never know we're in a dream state. And if you start thinking about your as lived awakened state, it's technically a thing we don't actually ever wake up from, but that's what waking up is. That is not what enlightenment is. It's there was a before, now there's an after. Suddenly I'm more awake than I was before. Holy shit, I was asleep. How would you know that you're asleep if you've never woken up from the dream? <laughs> so much, and right, this is all matrix stuff. So, so much of this has to do with you starting to accept that you are worthy by the way, worthy of feeling however it is you want to feel without the results predetermining when you get to feel that. How many of you guys are tracking what I just said? <laughs> and then, <laughs> go ahead. Brett Gibson, I, I've never heard Wayne Dyer say that. Now I'm looking to search for the video where he says that. It's like screwing your way to virginity. hundred <laughs> percent. So good. Just think about this, guys. You're not chasing money as much as you're chasing the feeling that money you think would provide once you get there. The part about money, though, is when you get there, it doesn't feel like anything. <laughs> you know, when you were like chasing the love of your life and then you had that thing for like three to six months, then you got married or whatever it was, and then that thing went away and it didn't feel that way anymore? Does that mean that's not the love of your life anymore? What went away? Notice how it never quite looks the way that we expect it to. And what a disappointment that is every time. So you're not, you're relegating yourself to a life of attachment. It's all these attachment things, things that are going to happen in the future, things that you don't want to let go of now that don't allow you to feel the things that you want to feel because you'd rather be attached to, I'm not good enough. Then you have an excuse. Rather be attached to, hey, you know, like, um, yeah, no, I, I, I don't take chances. You'd rather be right about the things that are actually causing harm in your life and keeping you where you are than letting go of that identity to see what gets to show up in its place. So I just want to kind of, in a roundabout way, start talking about these things because I just kind of want to like agitate your identity a little bit, not to piss you off and certainly not to tell you that the way you're doing things is wrong and we're not coming from there. It's just that what's predictable is that what you have now is what's going to continue to happen. That's feelings drive that you it's not, you don't attract it to yourself. What your what your emotional body allows for is not an attraction. It's an allowance. What are you allowing to enter your life? How many of you guys wake up in the morning, feel like shit and then have an awesome day or produce great results when you feel that way? It's, it's highly unlikely. And if you do, please write a book so the rest of us can join you because most of the world feels like shit and would love to produce great results. So there's, there's something here way deeper than using your intellect to understand the money game, right? You can go make all those investments. You can do all the things that actually produce a lot of money, what people consider wealth. 
when you get there, if you've made a lot of money, but you haven't dealt with your inner wealth, you are not going to feel wealthy at all. It is why many millionaires and billionaires just keep going, keep consuming, keep buying more shit. It's just never enough. It's like any drug addicted person, they just need the next dopamine fix. They need that next little hit and then it doesn't last long and they got to produce more, buy more, you know, and feel less essentially. And it's actually working against them. So hopefully that kind of gave you guys like a, a bit of a world of it. Uh, brilliant. And <laughs> a lot of you guys were commenting about what I was saying and there's just really beautiful things. I want to read Joe. You're on point today on fire. Joe says, feeling like I have to show up a certain way in front of others to be liked or effective in growing our business, feel exhausted by the end of the day from pretending. Now, whether your conversation is I'm not worthy, which I can assure you every single one of you right now that the reason the level of abundance of love, peace, finances that you want in your life hasn't showed up is because you flat out don't feel worthy of it. And you can tell me, no, Elon, I feel worthy of a million dollars. And I would say to you, what you currently have in your life exactly at this moment is what you believe you are worthy of. Nothing more, nothing less. You will never see more in your bank account than you feel worthy of. Period. End of story. So if we're really looking to have a massive breakthrough in our abundance, then we get to look at our worthy level of receiving love, our worthy level of receiving finances, our worthy level of receiving opportunities. So to uh, Joe's point, which I absolutely love, like how many of you feel exhausted at the end of the day? You are working so hard to create abundance, to feel abundant, to feel, you're, you're just working so hard and you're exhausted. And it's not producing any results. And it's a very frustrating feeling when you feel like you're putting in so much effort and it, there's nothing to show for it. I know I've done it for a long, long time. And I've done it because I wanted to look good. And I thought that that's the way things needed to be done. And I thought that I needed to prove myself to myself, my parents, my peers. It's fucking draining. Mm. Now, here's the thing. You all are magnificent manifestors. Magnificent manifestors. Guess what manifestation needs? Energy. So if you have a, a tube, let's call it, you know, like your fuel tank, okay? And you're spending your day trying to fit in, trying to belong, trying to be loved, trying to be accepted, um, trying to feel worthy, trying to make money, all that stuff. How much energy do you actually have to create manifestation and allow for all the goodness that we're talking about to show up? Not much. Not much. So now let me flip the role. We show you in a very systemized way how to reveal and reprogram all of these energy drains. And I give you a full tank and show you how you can use that tank to actually focus energistically on manifesting that which you want. Do you believe that with our process, our support, you would be able to use that energy to actually go out and very quickly manifest what you want in your life right now and create that abundance? Do you believe that you have the capabilities to do that? Yeah, there's some cool questions in that comment box. Like fun, fun ones to explore for sure. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Right? It's all inside of you. Every single one of you has already manifested amazing things in your life at different times. You've just done it without having any clue of how to do it right? Most people can make a pretty 
successful dish or write a pretty successful thing or make completely unconscious and by accident. The key is, can you do it over and over again? Do you understand how the law of allowance works? Do you understand how creating energy and what to focus on energy and creating that clarity and removing those blockages? Do you understand that process? And that's really what we want to share with you guys here today. So I'm, I'm excited. I know there's some questions in there, but look, I, my intention is to keep this to 60 minutes okay. because I really want to share with you guys what we've put together. Cause I am, I mean, you saw the, the videos that I did leading up to this. I'm fucking excited to share this with you. <laughs> I can't believe that it's taking us this long to be honest. I guess it's all perfect. And, and you know, time will tell. Um, we have spent months putting together a new program called prime your abundance. Okay. We've done live coaching. I mean, Justin Wilkerson was just on the call with us. We put the survey out every single time and every single time without fail, 70% of the room tells us that they are, that they want to break through in abundance, uh, breakthrough in finances. And I'm like, great, great. And so what do we do? We go create a program about uh, creating, you know, priming your day and priming your productivity because that makes sense, right? Um, and on the one hand, it does because having that program, which I know a bunch of you have and getting amazing results, like having that as a foundation is really integral, which is why we launched it first. I just know that you guys have spoken and we paid attention and we put this together and we we're really excited. Now, originally, here's the part that I'm really excited about. Originally, we were just gonna launch this two weeks ago. We had the whole product done. You know, Elon was gonna make a cute little sales video to explain to you what it was, and you guys would all buy it in hordes, I'm sure. We were gonna dress him like a little piggy while he did the sales video. <laughs> then I'm meditating and I get this download, and the download is that we, we have done a lot of landmark work. Uh, for those of you guys that don't know landmark education, we did a lot of work with them and they have something called a seminar series and a seminar series is like an ongoing on topic program. And so I'm meditating one day and it's like do seminar series. And I was like, Hmm, that's a cool idea. So then I shared the idea with guy and guys like, well, why don't we do that with prime your abundance? Why don't we actually invite people and have a seminar around money as an add on to this product? And I was like, dude, that just might be cool enough to work. So that's what this is. This is a coming out party for not only Prime Your Abundance, the product, but Prime Your Abundance, the seminar series. So, real quick, here's what it looks like. Yes, absolute divine timing, Magella. So just so you guys understand, Prime Your Abundance is basically an 18 module step-by-step -step process program that's going to take you through, let me just pull out my notes real quick, how to go internal, right? We spoke about like, I've been out here looking at this and video that and book this and nothing's working. How do we turn internal? We then look at your belief systems top to bottom reprogram all of it guy spoke about being right right like the things that you've been right about how to redo those we're going to talk about inner reference we're going to talk about how to instantly shift your energy into that mode where you can manifest from it different language upgrades how to rewrite your story around money nlp reprogramming tools around money we're going to debunk three of the biggest myths that we've heard people talk about money. Um, different exercise that we're going to take you through. And then how to uncover every limiting conversation you've ever had around money and many, many other things. There's live bonus training in there, etc. The thing I'm most psyched about, though, is the fact that in addition to that, for a very, very small group of you, and by very, very small group of you, I mean only 20 of you will be allowed into this program, okay? So unless there's like crazy overwhelmed demand for this, like we're gonna cap this at 20 people, and we're gonna do a beta group with you. 
This is the first seminar series we've ever done. Okay. Our intention, you're muted. Yeah. I was going to say on, on a single topic, yeah. on a single topic. We, yep. we always talk very holistically about things, but this is just about this. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So it's like going deep on abundance. Mm-hmm. Okay. So all the worthy issues, all of the trying to get rid of this, all the trying to prove stuff, we get to work with you live guy and I and you during coaching sessions. There's going to be four of these seminar sessions included when you join the beta group. Here's the requirement. You go through the program. So you go through all the recorded trainings in prime your abundance. You come every two weeks. We're going to do four sessions every two weeks over the next two months. You show up live to these coaching calls or at the very least watch the replay. You do the work. Two months from now, you completely shift your entire context around abundance. Money is flowing in your life. Love's flowing in your life. Opportunities are flowing in your life, etc. Our request is that you create a testimonial and you share this program and what it's done for you in your life publicly, or at least with us so that we can share it publicly. Because the idea is that we want this group to kind of be like the catalyst, right? I said line in the sand moment, catalyst for everyone that we come in contact with. Because guys, trust me, like abundance, manifestation, finances, lack of worth, all that stuff, massive conversations, right? There's plenty of people in your life that you would love to give that gift to, right? So in return for you going through doing that with us in this beta program, this program is going to sell for 997 bucks for the first 20 people that come into this program. You get the program for half of that. So 500 bucks. That's all the prime year abundance series plus the four seminar things with us. The only thing again that we require is that you actually go through this material, you go through the work, you come, you get your life, you get abundance, and then you give us a testimonial at the end that we can use going forward. That's it. This is by far the cheapest this thing will ever be. Um, Just so you guys know, our Ascension program, for example, which probably I think a year and a half ago we kicked off was 10 grand at beta. It's currently 36 grand. So prices rise with inflation, if you know what I mean. So if you've ever had any conversation around abundance, if you ever had any scarcity, any self-worth, anything like that, you're done with dealing with the bullshit of going external, done with the bullshit of buying another book or watching another video or sitting there meditating in silence because you have no idea what's happening and you really are ready to take this to the next level, for 20 of you, this is gonna be the most miraculous day of your life. And that's it. I'm open to any questions if you guys have anything specific about that. And if not, I know Guy wanted to uh, maybe add something in there and or uh, share about some of the questions that are there. Oh, you need to tell them the link and stuff like that. I didn't tell them. You're muted. There's no audio coming from you. Say it again. I can't hear you. Okay. I see you going like this, but I don't know. Is that like an NFL, like feed me? Like feed me. I just ran a touchdown. (laughs) Uh, Okay. So a couple of questions. Awesome, Marion. In. Awesome. Uh, oh, guy dropped the link in there. Okay. So satoriprime.com forward slash abundance, a bun dance. Nice and easy. Um, okay. It can be paid in installments. There is a uh, one time 500 bucks or two, two, payments, two of, payments of 300. Two payments of 300. There's your audio. Yeah, I don't, it, it is what it is. Um, yeah, guys. So when you sign up, just again, to be clear, we're actually selling the training, like the training with Elon and I, there's no live training that we do today that is anywhere near this price. Just so you understand, like we charge significantly more for our time today. 
Uh, again, as a beta program, we just like to kind of just get, get that first wave in. I also personally think there's like a lot of people who end up in our programs do come coaching inside our programs. And I think there's an opportunity here to create a, a, like an abundance program of people who then want to actually coach people as they go through this experience also. Um, Cause that's usually how our programs kind of pan out. So, you know, that's like a secondary type of maybe carrot out there that you can just continue to work with us on, on, on you becoming a coach, if that's something you're interested in doing. Um, and the program that we're going to sell separately is included with that. So it really is just kind of awesome. Um, I don't think we're going to release the program itself, right. For, for a bit. We, yeah. didn't, we didn't quite decide about how we're going to do that, but I think we're not going to, you know, at least until probably this is over. Um, so yeah, that's, that's pretty much where we're at. Um, there were definitely cool questions in there. I think all, all things to, um, that we can certainly explore with you guys. I just want to make sure that this, any questions we have around this particular product is handled right now. Yeah. I kept trying to edit, edit the, um, um, the description in the video. And for some reason it's not letting me, I'm going to try one more time. Edit the description. Yeah. So people can actually just have the link. Oh, got it. Got it. Got it. Okay, cool. Yeah, guys, again, like, you know, it's really interesting. We've never done a single topic ongoing conversation, um, which I think is, is really the experiment that we're going on altogether. Uh, it's always been much more holistic and people can bring in different things. Like this is just seriously two months of let's go really, really deep and what's blocking your uh, ability to receive abundance in your life right now. So yeah, we're, we're super, super, super stoked. Um, all right. So a couple of other questions. <laughs> Jim, I want to clean my fucking head out. I'm over it. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Patricio, just to be clear, there's 18 lesson recorded course and we get four groups. Yes, exactly. So there's like, hours of pre-recorded uh, abundance training. And then in addition, this is the gold. So the idea would be like, you guys start going through the recorded material, start getting all this stuff that happens in your life. And then we get to go on these calls and really dive deep with you um, on the group coaching calls. Um, okay. Awesome. Hayden's already in all paid one question. The page I go to calls it prime your productivity. Is that right, bro? That can't be right. Uh, I'm not sure. Or you're muted or it's your audio. Yeah, sorry. Working. Sorry. Yeah. I think it's just on the receipt page. I think I know why they probably just copied the page and don't okay. it up top. It's that's not a big deal. Okay. <clears throat> Cause the checkout page I saw just, yeah, that's great. working fine. Yeah. Okay. So okay, we'll, cool. all that other stuff will, we apologize if it's not perfect. We kind of like slept. It's beta thing. guys. Uh, awesome. Justin Wilkerson's in sweet. Um, the course, Michelle, is going to be over two months. So the, the pre-recorded stuff you have for life, you can go over it whenever you want. The live coaching with Guy and I, not with one of our coaches, with Guy and I ourselves, will be uh, over two months. So every two weeks, we're going to have a live group coaching call. Awesome. So we got a few of you already jumping on board. Guys, by the way, I just want to let you know so, cause you guys are on here live. So you get first dibs. Once 20 fills out, it's over. I'm letting you know that we had massive amounts of people all over the world. So for a lot of people, they can only watch this on replay. I'm not telling you to do this to, you know, bump them out, but like, there's going to be a lot of people watching this on replay. So if this resonates with you and you want in, like I would just jump all in. Um, uh, because I have a feeling once this goes replay, those 20 spots will, uh, will fill up very, very fast. Okay. I see also what happened guys. So if you purchased it and it took you to prime your abundance, I guess you just earned yourself an extra program for free. Um, <laughs> we'll just, we'll just do it that Find way. Your productivity, you mean? Yeah. The, the, th the thank you page was, uh, aiming at the wrong place. So I, I just 
fixed it, it'll go to the right place. If for any reason, uh, this way or that way, the email that's coming to your inbox should still be for Prime Your Abundance and you should still be able to get that program access. So whoever just got um, Prime Your um, prime your productivity. Sorry, we have too many prime yours at these days. <laughs> um, just consider that a, an extra bonus for being here and being an early mover. Yeah. Awesome. So I, th I think we already have a few of you in there. So Joe Messina is in, Zenobia is in, Zen for short, uh, Justin's in, Hayden's in, who else? Who else is uh, going in? And if you guys have any other questions or anything like that, uh, now would be the great time for that. Bro, is there anything you, else you wanted to add? No, I see, I see a lot of people that I've wanted to work with for a long time jumping in, I guess, I guess the right time. Yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, look, here's what I, I'll just add here. Beverly's in. Cool. While, while you guys are just doing your checkout stuff. Patricio's okay. in. Woohoo! I think, I think there's, I think they're just left. They're going to type it as fast as they They won't even pay, paying attention to what I'm going to say. Look, bottom line is if this last year, just so you guys understand, I'll say even the last 14 months, no, last 18 months, I know this year from beginning of the year till now, we've invested about a hundred grand. Last year we invested $300,000 in our personal development. So it's about $400,000 in the last 18 months. And we did it consciously because we, the people that we worked with, we saw manifesting in ways that were unprecedented. Like Elon and I were amazing at getting results with things. 10 years of landmark education. Trust me, your integrity is through the roof. You're getting shit done. The funny part was after having a business for about five years, him and I sat back. And one of the things that we would notice is when we would go on vacation is when we would make the most money. Weirdest thing in the world. Really didn't quite understand why. And this would keep happening to the point where I systematically went on more vacations just so we can make more money. I'm not joking. So if, if you guys have been following me, you can go on my personal Facebook page. This is not bullshit. I traveled five months of last year, five months. Did about 14 countries, 50,000 miles, plant medicine work all over the world, saw amazing experiences, went to go live with secret societies, you name it. It was like the works last year. I, my head was spinning at the end of it all. And the funny part was, is like that all came on the back of this inquiry looking at can we honestly say that working harder produced more results in our lives? And the thing is, we couldn't really find much evidence for it. Now, at least not as far as business is concerned. I know that we all grow up with, when you work hard, life works out for you. I don't know about you guys, and I don't know where you work, live in the world, but that's like a staple line of the United States of America. Guys, a lot of people aren't doing well. And if, and if that was the case, then everyone would be doing really well. There's a lot of people who are really good at working hard. The people that we know that are living the best lives, I don't just mean wealth-wise as far as money. I mean, just the wealthiest people we know. Best relationships, traveling the world, uh, most incredible people in their lives, unbelievable experiences open up to them. This is it. This, this is what they do. They work on this. This that we're bringing here to this abundance training. And, and it has nothing to do with what you understand. And it's gonna, for some of you guys, being in this program, not being able to understand is gonna be hard to understand. <laughs> but I wanna understand. But you wanna understand, because you think that manifestation is a thing that you get to understand. There's a really big difference between understanding and then knowing. When you listen to teachers who seem to have, it's not because of what they're saying that's different, because most of us, really, we're just saying the same shit. However, you can kind of tell when somebody's talking about something and it sounds intellectual versus realized. Realized meaning that they know it because they've lived it. They felt it. Somebody who talks about uh, raising a child to somebody who hasn't raised a child, I can understand that. I've never raised a child. I don't know it. Certainly it hasn't been realized, right? Stuff like that. And that goes across for every single thing on planet earth. If you haven't had an as lived as felt experience with this thing, it's why it's not shifting. What we propose here is that this training is about making your life really easy. How many guys, um, I don't have it up right now, but I'll put it up so I can see how many guys want it to be easy. How many guys are just fucking tired of it being hard? I 
I can't see a comment box. Can you I check was, it for I me? Was pointing to me? Huh? I was just pointing to me. Oh, yeah. Us too. Us too. We want it to be easy. That's why we invested so heavily in our own education because I'm like, I'm fucking tired of it being hard. I see some people are doing it so easy. What, what, how are they operating? And by the way, we asked that how question, how are they doing that for like at least the first six months? Our intention. Guys, is, by the way, 10 spots are already taken. Cool. If I'm, if I'm counting correctly. So cool. Some of them are gone already. Yeah. Our intention is that this, this easy way of living becomes like breathing to you. It doesn't become understanding. If, if all you get from this program is, oh, now I know what Elon and Guy are talking about, I'll be fucking disappointed. I really will. If what this opens up for you is an ease and effortlessness around attracting what you want in your life, whether it's money, wealth, or health, or the relationship, whatever it is, where, again, it'll be talking about this abundance, but it's like, what does abundance mean to you? To some people, that's just living at home and having like a really connected family. They don't need a lot of money. That's abundant to them. You guys get that? For other people, it's traveling the world. That's abundant to them. For other people, it's like having 75 children. That's abundant to them. <clears throat> for some people, it's not about money. And, and for those people, by the way, if you make it about money, it's why you don't have any. Because <laughs> that, that's not how you operate, right? Like one of the biggest breakthroughs we had in our business when we stopped goal setting around money sounds completely counterintuitive to what every other person on the planet will teach you. We got really real with ourselves. And the one thing that drives Elon and I more than anything in the world is being of service to other people. We just, for lack of a better word, we get off on that shit like crazy. <laughs> like Elon and I, I shit you not. We can, we can sign up a person into our Ascension activation program, which can look like a 3000 to $10,000 a month payment to us. No, no chump change for a lot of people. That's life altering income. And him and I will be like, dude, that's amazing. Like what we're excited though about more is we'll get like a comment. I know this is funny, especially for those of you in our programs, we'll get like a comment from like someone like Justin or Lloyd or like a bunch of other people that have been in the group recently who just found us podcasts, whatever. I've gone through a few things. Um, what was the gentleman we did the podcast with a few weeks ago? We did the live coaching with him. Andrew. Yeah. With Andrew. And those people reach out to us and write us like their life story like this and how going through their podcasts and going in our group has changed their life. And Eli and I are like, read it, read it. Did you see that? We get so excited about it. So we, we made this agreement with ourselves that goal setting was, was all in the world of intellect. We're going to operate from our intuition and what we're looking for as an as lived result of living this way is that we get at least 10 acknowledgements per day anywhere on so social media and email and our support inbox, like something like that. We know we will have achieved a certain level of which where we want to be in our company when 10 people a day are acknowledging us. Now, if you're wondering how acknowledgements turn into like money in the bank, because honestly, like money in today's world, at least for the time being is important, at least until that cryptocurrency thing kicks in. Um, you know, and, and at that point in time, like it, you got to look at, if you have that many people acknowledging you, think about the type of followers that you have. That's almost over 3,600, like pretty faithful followers at the, that point in time. If 20% of those people, even if 10% of those people end up buying programs from you over a year long period, you guys do the math. You're talking about millions of dollars and you never even have to think about the money. You just think about what it is that you love doing and how do you serve that environment to the best of your ability. And then you, should, you better fucking have the integrity to invest in yourself and become the best at what it is that you're putting out there, which is what we keep doing. I don't know about you guys, but no matter what you do in this world and what you choose to invest in, the one investment that always pays off is the investment over here. Now, people oftentimes mistake what investments are for. They only measure investments and monetary returns, which I think is kind of stupid. No offense to you if you do that. It's a way to measure things. It's not the way to measure things. Oftentimes, investments return in relationships, and everybody knows this. It's not what you know, it's who you know, or it comes back in experiences, which are way more valuable than any money you will ever put in your bank account, because guess what? When you die, you don't take the money with you. The experiences, though, that leaves a mark right? 
And you could say money if that, if that works for you, great. But after, like I said, roughing it for five years, you know, 14 to 16 hour work days, five, six days a week, blah, 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 blah. We did all that and we preached all that. And then something shifted and we got to see the world in a whole new way with this ease and effortlessness. So I didn't get, again, I didn't check in the comment box like how many guys actually said that, but how many guys like just want it to be easier? We get to look at why are you making it hard? You know, what is it that you learned when you were a kid that, that told you you're supposed to make it hard? Why is it that you still believe that if it's not working for you? Because if you can find evidence for that working harder is doing more for you, getting you in life where you want to get to go, having the relationships that you want to have, the body that you want to have, the travel that you want to have, whatever it might be for you. And if that's not working, this might be for you. If you still want to do the Gary Vaynerchuk thing, work yourself to the bone until you see just little prickly little fingers and you know, you're okay with your relationships at home not being so great. And I love Gary, by the way. He's like one of the people I'd love to sit and have dinner with. It's just not the kind of lifestyle that I want. And, we're, and this is not for everybody. This is for people who, who want to tune into that other side of it and get really, really good at being trained at having it be easy. I want a world of miracles and ease. That's what I'm all about. If you guys are up for playing that game with us, exploring how to, become, how to open that, those doors up for yourself, getting intuitive into that field and start producing things in your life in a way that's unexpected and you're willing to go through whatever experiences and opportunities come your way in order to unlock those doors because it's going to be different for all of you. Guys, you need to go in there and experience some things that you probably haven't wanted to experience. Attraction, again, said differently, allowance, all comes down to how you feel about yourself. If you don't feel worthy, you don't receive. Like as simple as I can make it. This is going to be a, a, a spirituality 101 and how to get your self-worth up. You get your self-worth up, a whole lot of things become available to you that were not before. I hope that lands. Bro, any other questions? Anything else you want to hit on? Because we're I'm just, at top of the I'm hour just, almost. I'm just answering uh, some people here. Some people said like the site was uh, slowing down. Other people were just saying that the link uh, wasn't working. So I just resent it. Uh, Michelle was asking about, is there a possibility we can help others do this as well to become coaches? Yeah. I mean, uh, for those that don't know, our Ascension program is actually a full on coaching accreditation program. So you go through your year journey with us. And in the midst of that, you actually get accredited as a coach as well. So that's something we can look at Michelle for sure. Um, but yeah, I mean, listen, if you're already a coach and you want to have some insights around your breakthroughs around abundance and thereby share those with others. Yeah, by all means. I mean, um, your breakthrough is their breakthrough. Awesome. Yeah. So Michelle, if, if that's something you're open to, um, you can fill out an application, um, to do that. You can private message me. I know you just sent me a friend request, so private message me. I can send you a link to, uh, to grab an application and we can have that conversation as well. Yeah. It's, uh, okay. I think 16 spots now. So three more come in just right now. Awesome. Yeah, guys. So it's, it's running out, um, real quick. Again, depending on, on um, demand, if we see that like a bunch of you guys are, are pounding down the door after 20, I think Guy and I will have a conversation. We'll probably, what we'll do is we'll raise the price. Uh, maybe we'll take it to like, I don't know, 600 or 700 bucks or something like that uh, for the next five or 10 people or something like that. And then just see, see how that goes. But yeah, I'm, uh, I'm really happy to have a bunch of you in here. I think it's gonna be an absolutely amazing journey. For those that start, asked about start time, uh, we're gonna give this replay like at least you know, 24, 48 hours because there's so many people from all over the world who are messaging us like, I'm not gonna be there, it's 3 a.m. in the morning, blah, blah, and they were crying. So um, that's why I said you know, we might have to open this a little bit, uh, but in any event, um, I think that we'll probably kick this off in the next week or two. In the meantime, you guys should already, do they already have access to Prime Your Abundance, bro? Like when yeah. they register? And if for any reason something clunky didn't work, technology, there's like 5 million things to connect for every product that we do. 
um, just support ethstoryprime.com. We'll get you sorted like immediately. Yeah. I'll make, I'll make sure that we're, we're here looking at everything so we can get you sorted right away. And just as a side note, you know, again, this is beta. You're the first people to go through this course. You're the first people to be in the seminar program, all of it. So like your feedback is paramount. It's the reason we're giving you guys a huge discount is that we can kind of go through this with you. If there's any other pieces, if something doesn't work, if there's additional support or anything like that, that you guys are requesting, uh, please, please, please be in communication with us. That's how we're just going to make this uh, a much better product that we all feel so, so proud to share with friends and family and everybody else. So um, yeah, for those of you guys who already registered, I mean, kudos, welcome to the party. Patricio, that was a, Patricio, that was a very sweet message. Got that. And I'm very excited we get to work together again also. Abundance. What did you, was uh, he right? Oh, I got it. Yeah, he said we were, on, we were on his vision board and he was looking for ways to work with us but didn't know how and then this happened. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I intend that a lot more of those kind of events like that where you, like what, what people consider miracles, I assert will become your normality. Guys, so like I, I don't, I don't want to portray this as any sort of guarantee in two months. This is, this is something that took us quite a bit of time to stop fighting against. You have to get how much programming you have about doing things to get things. There's a lot of shit to sift through. What I can guarantee you is that we're going to set a really strong foundation and we're going to get you operating in a way that's extremely unconventional. I mean, that like the 1% are operating at. Very unconventional. Like even some of the best books you read on earning and da 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 they don't talk about this shit. Like I went through, a, you guys use Blinkist? It's like a really cool app on your phone for like digesting books in like 10, 15 minutes, kind of like a, a modern um, Cliff Notes type of thing. I went through a whole bunch of Blinkist this morning about like wealth creation and stuff. It's, <laughs> they don't talk about this. This is not in many books. Um, one of the favorite things I'm sharing these days, I'm reading this amazing book by Ken Wilber and um, <clears throat> it's called The Religions of Tomorrow. It's, it's thick. So if you're not into... Yeah, it's thick. It's like 30 hours of reading. Okay. It's a really, really thick book. And he talks about evolution. And, and I don't know if you guys know this, but Darwinianism or Darwinism, I keep saying Darwinianism, Darwinism, for the most part, there's an aspect to it that's true, but a lot of it has been kind of disproven. Not so much to say that it's not accurate. It's just that it's not the full picture. Okay. And, and there's a theory that goes that the reason that they're keep teaching it is because the schools just don't want to pay for new books, which makes sense. So, you know, I usually go with the easy solution. So we'll just take that as the truth for the time being. What I, what I love about what he says though, is that for evolution to occur, if you think about the Darwin model, these two entities would have to mutate in the same location at the same time. And, and this, we're going back hundreds of thousands of years where people didn't live the way that we live today. There was very few people on the planet, different continents, traveling was different, obviously, right? You'd have to have these two people who evolved in the same way, who then find each other, have a child and pass on that, that mutation, make sure the child is safe, then that child will find somebody with that mutation and so on and so forth. It's, it's a very improbable event to have occurred. Could have happened, just very improbable. What research shows today is that what we're calling evolution is actually an extension of our emotional body. So the subtle vibrations in the body and how we choose to change those or how we alter the way that those operate will actually turn on and off your genes. This is science. This is not, I'm not making this up. You can go look in the books. How you feel about things will turn on markers and off markers in your body and literally change your genetic makeup. This happens very quickly. It happens on the, pretty much on the fly, which means the thing that's most connected to you evolving, passing on that data to a child or anybody else on the planet is how it feels internally. So this conversation is all about that. This training is all about that. And the reason I'm telling you this is to get you excited because I, when I go do research on who's teaching this stuff right now, the pool of people is really small. And that you're at the forefront of what it means to evolve in this way to reach a new state of consciousness with what people have been calling attraction, mark, with not attraction marketing, but attraction to themselves. Again, really going back to what are you allowing, not what are you attracting? Because what you're allowing is what you're going to attract. So I just want to get you guys really psyched about that. 
because this is not a common conversation. And even when people are having it, they're trying to understand it. And there's a whole other part of you that gets to know this. And once it's in, it's in. It's like riding a bicycle. You can only get a bike by feeling how it feels to get balance on a bicycle. Then you can't unlearn it. It becomes the way that you see the world. It becomes ontological and, phenomenal and becomes the phenomenology through which you live through. That's what we can guarantee is we're going to set a foundation for you to completely operate in the world in a way that's literally on the cusp of evolution in terms of states, like what state you want to enter in consciousness. And I think that's fucking exciting. <laughs> Beautiful guys. Uh, Stephanie, I know uh, you're, you're keep trying, keep going girl. Uh, I just left you a little message there for you personally. Um, hopefully that works. If not private message me and we will, uh, figure that out. Um, Risky, we're really close. We have to be like one or two away. Yeah. I just want to be mindful. Yeah. So just Steph private message me, I'll put you on the list and I'll, I'll make sure, uh, that we, that we honor it. Cause I know that you still wanted to jump on, uh, guys, again, once this goes, uh, over the 20 mark, the price so if you guys are watching this on replay and you go to the page, the price will automatically adjust. So it'll just be the new price. Um, Guy and I will talk about it. Um, we just weren't sure exactly kind of the demand, but uh, we do want to keep this group, you know, not Pretty in the tight. hundreds of people. So yeah. Um, yeah, if you guys have any other questions or anything like that, you can either private message me on Facebook or just email me Elon I L A N at Satori prime.com. And if any of you guys are on replay, obviously uh, tag us in the comment box. If you're leaving a message or a question and you want to leave it there, make sure you tag either guy or myself. Otherwise uh, we won't be able to find that comment. All right. <laughs> Magella. Ah, I just got a new client while this was on. Yeah. We intend a lot more of that happens. <laughs> a lot more of that will happen. Guys, um, we look, I mean, there's people of you like Marguerite knows. There you go, uh, Stephanie. You got in. They're, they're Steph's in. Yep. Awesome. See Steph, what did you give up? <laughs> what did you have to give up? What did you notice? And what did you have to give up? Um, there is an energy when you're around energy of abundance, it it's osmosis, right? Like you guys being around this, being around people that are having this conversation, things are naturally going to show up. I mean, look, Magella got a, a client just by the virtue of being here and saying yes to the program. Not yet, we haven't even started. She hasn't even done a single module, right? So that is really what is accept, what is available to you. Fear of missing out on the experience now. Timing would be right in the right time. See, like, isn't that interesting? Notice even that, like fear of missing out, and all of a sudden that energy creates blockage. That's exactly what we're talking about, guys. Exactly, right there. This stuff that's unconscious. I literally typed her a message and was like, hey, notice where the resistance is or what you're afraid of or anything like that. Then let it go. See if you notice it, let it go and try again. And boom right then and there. So we're going to talk a lot about that during the, during this process. All right, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Um, so excited to take you all on the abundance journey and uh, we'll talk to you all soon. Yeah. I just want to uh, take responsibility for any of the technical issues. I see like the, one of the emails came out the wrong headline. Uh, again, if you have any issues at all, we do apologize for that kind of stuff. Um, again, we'll be happy to support you to make sure you have access to the program. That's probably the most important thing right now. Like we have, we have everyone's names, everything's in the system. We'll email you guys. So we'll get everything sorted with you that way. Um, obviously, um, the most important thing is you have that program. Uh, just so you guys know, you can, once you have access to the program, it's on your phone, mobile device, make sure you have our Satori prime app. That's either on the Android store, uh, or the iOS store. Um, it's awesome. Plus you have your own private community in there. So you guys can chit chat with one another about what you're going through, which we actually urge you to do. That way we can give you uh, private feedback on anything that's coming up for you while you're in there. Um, you can also get our desktop, uh, app as well. Uh, that's at app.satoriprime.com app.satoriprime.com. It works either ways. Uh, for those of you guys who've never used our app before, 
It's a fully gamified experience. It keeps track and scoring using all these little awards and it literally keeps track of where you are in the program. It will also remind you to go back to the program if for some reason you forget to go through it. Um, we intend that this actually gets started soon, right, Brown? Like in the next... Yeah, I said next week or two. Next week, yeah. So I, I'm also starting to travel again in May, so we want to make sure we get this rocking before I'm, I'm uh, off on the next trip. Um, yeah, and that's it, guys. Again, yeah, if you have any issues at all, don't fret. Just email support at satoriprime.com. We'll get you sorted right away. Yeah, by the way, I think we only have... Uh, I, I, I couldn't really count. I may have miscounted, but I think we only have one or two spots left. Yes, that sounds about right to me. All right. Welcome to the party, everyone. Love you, love you, love you. We will reach out to you here in the next couple of days, let you know of where this is going. And um, yeah, get ready. You already said yes. So now just allow for miracles of abundance to show up in your life. You already started the process. Love you guys. Love you guys. Thank you for joining us and uh, investing some time with us. We look forward to working with those of you who signed up um, directly. It's going to be really exciting and a fun experiment together. And yeah, if you, anybody else has any questions, again, uh, support at Satori Prime or Guy or Elon at SatoriPrime.com and we'll happily uh, help you out. Bye, everybody. Love you so much. Bye-bye.